Um, I just have to say that I started kayak fishing five years ago, and uh, but I fished before from kayaks. But there was no sit and top kayak, it was not a fishing kayak, just a normal Canadian, whatever you call it, just normal canoes. And uh, I started because um, I love kayaking, I was always a kayaker. And uh, I love fishing because I, I, I fished when I was five years old. And I started with four or five years, yeah, with my grandpa. And uh, I love to be on the water, I love to be. Uh, yeah, just in, in this uh, outdoor world okay. and uh, have this environment around me, surrounded by me. Yeah. When you're in areas like this one here with the pikes, um, it's more of this stealth fishing, right? You have this uh, silence and you can uh, get in um, spots where a motorboat can't and you have uh, ability to uh, just put put it on the roof and just go somewhere else when when you uh, have a, a, a spot where no fish is the fishing is not good so you go somewhere else honestly contest fishing is for me just more fun to be uh, together with awesome people it's uh, I think the event is great. It's uh, awesome to have all these people addicted fishermen around just uh, Be here have fun with all and Fun is the best thing you can have eh? It sounded like Swatsonka, right? Ah, oh, look at this! It's floating! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ah, was one of the best memories I had here in Karlskrona this year in the beginning when we were here with uh, Jim Salmons. Uh, I was just the, the salmon trawling we did. It was awesome. Six hours on the water with no fish and then a big salmon strikes your lure. That was, yeah, that was one of my biggest. Um, the bloodiest thing I had was, I don't know, there was no. None. Okay. I don't. I don't. <laughs>